boxing, he was victorious, Diego Barone, number one in the country in his weight class. Um, a little bit tougher than you expected. How, how was your opponent? In, in, you know, Armando Juarez from San Antonio, good fighter. What did you think of your opponent? Was a little tougher than you expected for the first round? Uh, yeah, he was a lot tougher than what I expected, but you know, still pulled through to get the win, and that's all that matters. Um, you seem to figure out a lot. The first round didn't really seem to go your way, but you dominated the last two rounds. What did you see? What, what, what did you pick out in the first round? What changed after the first round? Uh, what changed after the first round? Uh, first round, it was kind of hard to figure him out. Second round, I landed a good uh, left hook to the body. I could tell that I hurt him because he dropped his hand. So that's that's what I saw throughout the fight. Second round, uh, continued the third. Being from Dallas, you're there with a fellow Texan, uh, an Alamo San Antonio native. Is there a little bit of rivalry? Is there a little extra motivation to beat you know a, a fellow Texan in there? Yeah, it is. Uh, yeah. Did you know anything about him before? Have you, have you seen him before? Your, oh, oppo uh, your, your opponent? Uh, no, I haven't seen him before. He's uh, brand new to me, so. Well, she'll be back tomorrow. Yes, sir. Uh, do you know who your opponent is? Do you know who we're fighting yet? Uh, no, no, not yet. We don't have, we have no idea. All right, tell them where they can find you on social media. I'll let you go. Uh, you can find me uh, on Instagram at Diego the Future, and uh, that's about it, so. You're out of Mesquite, Texas, right? Yes, sir. Number one in the country, Diego Barone. God bless you. Thank you.